on behalf of TVLesson.com. Hi, my name is Athena Reich, and I'm an actress, singer-songwriter, host, and teaching artist. AthenaReich.com. In this clip on how to produce a music event, I'm going to talk about producing a fundraiser. A really wonderful thing you can do is raise money for a charity that's important and meaningful to you. And, you know, there's so many ways to raise money. You could, you know, charge a cover at the door. Musicians are happy to perform for free often, or maybe you can give them a little bit of money, you know, as, a, as an honorarium. Um, you could have a silent auction. I mean, you, you don't, it doesn't just have to be a music event. You can make it grow into a silent auction. You could have artists auction off, you know, their CDs. Um, you could have, you know, uh, or, 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 or sometimes, Artists are happy to say, you know, if you buy a CD from the artist, they'll give two dollars from each sale towards the charity. You know, or some percentage. Um, you could, um, you know, you could have the the fundraising, the, the charity organization, be there with a table and pamphlets, doing outreach to the community and educating the people. You know, invite them to come and have set up a table and get up on stage and do a little announcement about the benefits of it. You know, they can put out envelopes on the table and so people can make even more, you know, write out checks for them. So producing a fundraising, a fundraiser can be not only satisfying for the artist because there's a large crowd, but it can be really meaningful. So you've chosen your venue, you've found a venue that's gonna let you produce an event. Now you need to discuss the details. Um, are the artists going to get a free meal and a drink out of the deal? Are they going to get paid? Are you going to get paid for promoting the event? Is the, is the venue just going to hand you some money for doing it? Are they going to give you 10% of the bar? Are, you know, are they going to help promote it? Do they have resources, a mailing list, you know, flyers, pamphlets that they can help you know, produce and promote? Do they have a calendar they can put you on and display you in the store? Do they have, you know, can they put up your posters in their store? So you need to negotiate these details and of course try and get as much as you can from them you know, within reason. And um, don't be surprised if they want you to do it completely free and completely on your own, especially in major cities. In smaller towns, um, you can, uh, funny, ironically enough, they, they will sometimes just, you know, outright give you $200 or $300 or even more. But in bigger cities, um, the way it works, they, they just often cannot afford or they do not give money. So be clear and upfront and have a business meeting with the owners and the managers and see what you can negotiate.